appearing. Nice. So here we have it people, we got the Sony Link Buds here and I'm a bit late on this game and obviously I'm not going to do the same thing as all these tech mafias are doing. Um, when it comes to YouTube, we all know that there's no point copying what they're doing about this unboxing and going with specs and sharing their experience. I want to try something different here. As you know, I have actually been uploading about 40 videos related to earbuds so far. So I'm going to focus on the customer point of view in a more realistic way so that you guys, my viewers, will get benefit out of it. So to win hearts from YouTube algorithm system, I'll be carrying out a different method of reviewing this Sony Link Buds. For example, I'll be placing these earbuds into my binaural device called Bruv here so when the sound comes in he will record the sound for you so when you watch this video it will actually feel like you're actually listening to this earbuds also I'll be carrying out a sound leak test as well and other stuff that um, surprisingly most youtubers have not um, being actually covering for the context of their video so I hope you find this video useful so let's get on to it I'm going to play different tracks, uh, different tones of music to see how well you can listen to me. So while I actually record the music, um, I'm also going to talk to my bruv here. So here it goes. Okay, bruv, can you hear me? I'm talking to you now. This is a bit loud. Hello, hello. Now I'm going to turn it down. Hello, my name is LJP Tech. Nice to meet you. Or I'm going to speak quietly. Okay, so we're playing classical music and I'm trying to talk to my bruv here. Bruv, I'm actually shouting a bit, trying to have a conversation with you. Um, our normal talk. Hey bruv, how's it going? Can you hear my voice? I mean, I know you're listening to classical music. Can you hear my voice? Now, we're in the middle of the train and I'm trying to whisper to you. Bruv, do you know what you did last night? Do you know how many drinks you had last night? You were quite funny last night. Okay. 
Okay, so this is rather chill music. So I'm actually talking to Bruv here in a normal tone, quite close to me, about 60 millimeters away from him. But if I were to talk to him very quietly, So let's hear about the balancing voice in regards to the current world affair. So the link bud is going to play the CNN voices while we're going to turn on the computer sound from Fox News in regards to the same subject that I don't want to mention about. So here it goes. Intelligence agency Matthew Shoemaker. Um, I want to start with you, Matthew, uh, and talk about what we to diplomatic to options. Today, but according right? to the latest U.S. intelligence assessment, Russia now has close to 75 percent of its conventional forces postured. Putin also, I'm actually speaking troops. out at the same time. So I don't let's know take a look at it. And, and first of all, let's well. take it from Putin's I'm perspective. To if we can. CNN is also talking. NATO member. And also NATO Fox member. News is NATO member, show, that's so what started all this, hear my this voice. movement of NATO to can the you hear me? east, and that's the view that... Now let's find out how much a sound leak it produced when you play a loud techno music in a maximum volume. So currently it's in the medium volume level, so let's see how much of a sound leak it is based on a techno music. I think that's pretty good actually. Um, despite it's a very quiet place we have here. Now let's actually tune up to the maximum volume. Yeah, that kind of feels like those standard earbuds that doesn't have much of a soundproof or ambient sound kind of function, does it? So there's a lot of sound leak there. So there you have it people. This was a completely different outcome of what I expected. I actually thought that you'll be able to hear what's happening around you very clearly because it has this uh, rim design with a hole in the middle and in fact because of the um, rim sound system it is actually the sound wave is actually preventing you to hear what's happening with you in other words unless you really volume down to the lowest level you can't really listen to what's happening around you in fact I actually tried with my Sony XM4 earbuds with the no without the noise cancellation the ambient sound system and you can actually get a better sound quality listening to your own music while listening to your surrounding reality sound as well. So my question is why has Sony produced such design? Is it for targeting people who like to listen to quiet music? For a guy like me, I love to listen to loud techno music. So it depends on what sort of customers they're targeting. But for me, it's it's not on really. And the other question is, why are the tech YouTubers who are the early hand purchaser or holders of this item glorifying it, but in fact not mentioning about the negative side and the truth about this earbud is what really puzzles me. My best guess is, well, I actually pay my own money. So I'm actually um, reviewing this in a customer point of view. My best assumption will be these um, really well-known tech YouTubers they would have received a free gift from Sony as a review and they don't really want to bash Sony products um, unless they want to discontinue the relationship with Sony. That's my best assumption and very brutal truth here. Don't get me wrong, I'm not trying, I'm not against any Sony products. I got one of the best Sony um, XM4 headphone, like, sorry, headphones product and also the earbuds here and I love it. These are one of the best sounding um, device that I have and I'm really proud of it, proud of it but when it comes to the link buds it is a bit of a failure actually I do like the philosophy about using the recycled materials but in the end I really want to keep the original package but I have to as you have seen tear up the front um, paper cover and all I have left is a gray boring box here so I don't think I'll be able to resell it um, or unless um, someone's willing to keep it in this condition it does it just destroys the original taste as as well so I'm hugely disappointed but in fact I feel like a victim here because I listen to all these tech um, well-known tech youtubers hoping that this will be a brilliant product but in fact I reckon within a week I'm gonna get bored with it so um, they lured me and I'm trying to tell you guys, my viewers, the honest truth here. So I hope 
you understand where I'm coming from. I'm sorry, Sony, but I still cannot understand why you produce this product. I know you guys have been the frontier of the new technology, and I really enjoy observing your new tech. I mean, you've been far better than Apple of what they're doing so far. But I have to say, unfortunately, this link bud has really disappointed me. And I hope more YouTubers will come out with honesty regards to this. But anyhow, I hope this video you find it useful. But if you think I'm lying, please challenge me with your honesty as well. I look forward to hear your negative comments and um, criticism about me uh, on the comment section below. But um, otherwise, um, I hope I was being very brutally honest here and also I hope you really enjoy watching this video but anyhow thank you very much for watching this video this is LJP Tech all the best bye bye